Now I'm going to talk about, um, I was going to talk about two more types of connector, but I'm actually just going to talk about one, because it's an important one. In Czech, it's part of the culture in a way to show some humility sometimes. So when you're giving an opinion, rather than just being bold or arrogant if you want and blurting out your opinion, often a Czech will qualify it by saying something like, well, it's only my opinion, but, or, you know, I'm not really an expert on this, however, and so on. So in Czech, perhaps more so than in English, qualifying connectors are used quite a lot. So after you've used a opening connector where you may say, hmm, to je taková dobrá taska, then before giving your answer, you may want to qualify the answer. And I've got quite a few of these on my website. I don't know, 30 or something, and there are, you can just keep adding to them. Um, and I've put a few of them on this whiteboard here. So one we've used already is podle mého názoru, in my opinion. Uh, so rather than just stating something as a fact, you might want to say podle mého názoru to je, vel, no, to, to je velmi drahé. That is very expensive. So uh, instead of just saying that's expensive in a shop, you can say podle mého názoru to je velmi drahé, no? You, you see? Um, You've qualified it, so the person can think, well, it's just your opinion. Um, pokud vím. Pokud means as far as. Vím means I know. As far as I know. Um, pokud vím, to je trošku drahé. That's a little bit expensive. Trošku, a little bit expensive. As far as I know, that's a little bit expensive. Um, you never know, but nikdy, never, nevita, no, you don't know, sorry. In Czech, you use double negatives, so you never don't know, but nikdy nevita, ale, ale, da 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 da. So, the next one is pokud se nemilim, as far as I am not mistaken. As far as to myself, I don't make a mistake. It's what, yeah, so... Um, pokud se nemilim, ja musím říct, I must say that, že... Okay, so you will often qualify things before saying them. Um, and you, nobody wants to seem like the big-headed know-it-all, so... Um, nejsem takový odborník. I'm not such a, takovu means such a, um, expert, odbornik. Nejsem takový odbornik, ale podle mého názoru. So you can see you can keep combining them, to showing you some uh, humility. Um, jestli je to pravda, if it is true, so you're, again, not stating something is absolutely a fact, if, jestli, Yeto, it is pravda true. Um, jak asi víte? How maybe you know? So that's saying, like you already probably know, like you might already know. Um, so, nejsem takový odborník, ale podle mého názoru to je, jak asi víte, trošku drahé. So, I'm not such an expert, but according to my opinion, as maybe you know, that's quite expensive, a little bit expensive. You see the idea? So you're qualifying the statements. So, um, já se domnívám, že domnívám, I presume, se dom, yeah, já se domnívám, I to myself presume that, já se domnívám, že to je, whatever. 
Um, vidim to tak, že. I see, vidim means I see it so that, or the way I see it, this means I see it so that. No. Nejsem takový odborník, I'm not such an expert, ale vidím to tak, že to je, yeah, qualifying. Um, aha. Um, já vím, že. I know that. Já vím, že já nejsem takový odborník, ale já musím říct, da, 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 da. já vím, že. I know that. To je věc názoru. To je, it is, věc, a thing, názoru, of opinion. It is a thing of opinion, or it is a matter of opinion. So, I know, já vím, že to je věc názoru, a, and, já nejsem takový odborník, ale já musím říct, že podle mého názoru to je velmi da 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 da. Okay, so you can keep combining this like with all the connectors and just keep going. Um, so if somebody has asked you to do something and you don't want to puff and pant, you may say, to není velký problém. It isn't a big problem. Um, Combine them. Pokud vím, no pokud, já nejsem takový odborník, ale pokud vím, as far as I know, to není velký problém. No, to není takový velký problém, no. Um, vím, že, já vím, že to je věc názoru, ale pokud, oh, <laughs> pokud vím, to není takový velký problém. So you're combining all these things together. Rozumím li dobře. Um, if I understand well. Okay. So, já vím, že to je věc názoru, ale rozumím li dobře. Já musím říct, že to není takový velký problém. So just combining all these things together for qualification, qualifying them like this. There are many more of these, as I've said in the video um, earlier. Um, by going to my website, you'll see maybe 30 of them. And importantly, you shouldn't really just be sticking with the 100 that I've put on this website. They'll just be a springboard to get you started. And um, as you work with Czech, you'll come up with your own personalize this list, expand on it, find those that uh, more suit your style of conversation. And as you're reading through texts or having conversations, you'll pick up new ones and you'll go, oh, that's a conversational connector. I can use that one again. And so this is it. They should be living things, not just a static list. My, the hundred I've given is just a starting point. So uh, the next video will um, look at another kind of connector, just as useful as qualifying connector.